open that space up, right? Like, you know, we're not getting that 50-50, but we're anything like it. I think back, there's only been two male protagonists that I've read in a, in a required book. And one of them was, it was, I read The Giver and um, Catcher in the Rye. And Catcher in the Rye, of course, is a great novel. Uh, I particularly enjoyed it. But every other novel that we read, I didn't feel connected to them at all. Um, mostly because of the female protagonist. But it also seemed like in a lot of those books that we read, they had the same problems. I'm Amanda from Brooklyn Friends School and I'm at the 2016 Quaker Youth Leadership Conference and I'm here with... I'm Sarah. I'm from the Friends Seminary in Manhattan, New York. So we just saw the film The Mask We Live In and what did you think of that film? Well, um, I thought that I knew a lot about kind of mental health but I hadn't really thought that much about how it affected boys but the movie kind of taught me a lot and I have a younger brother who's nine and we're very close and so just the movie talked a lot about how boys are often, they feel like they can't express their emotions and I just, it made me think a lot about how grateful I am that my brother feels comfortable enough to express his emotions to him. And what did you learn from the discussion that we had afterwards? Um, I don't know, it was just very, it was very interesting to hear different people's kind of stories about like how they had been raised in regards to gender roles and like from the boys to hear their thoughts on whether or not they feel comfortable enough to express their emotions. So what are your names and what school do you guys go to? I'm Lola and I go to Mary McDowell. Friends. I'm Clara, I also go to Mary McDowell. I'm Sharon, <laughs> I go to Mary McDowell. I'm Jill and I go to Mary McDowell. So what did you guys like about this conference? I liked the food. It was good. Yeah. I liked all the amazing people and the really fun workshops that we got to do. Uh, I liked feeling um, inspired and empowered. What's your name and what school do you go to? My name is Finn Ridley. I go to Sipford School from England. What did you like about this conference? That you can sort of just talk to anyone new. You can talk to anyone and like, they'll talk to you back as if they've known you for years. Uh, it's really great how all the workshops and activities are wonderful. It's great how everyone can just be friends here. Just go up and talk to anyone. I'm Jordan and I go to Friends Seminary. What did you like about this conference? Um, I love being with my friends. I love meeting new people. I think it's really fun to be with a group of people who are all at Quaker schools because you're not like the odd one out, you know? Yeah, it was really cool. We got to have awesome discussions and I got to meet new people. It was super fun. I thought it went great. I had a lot of fun organizing it. I liked planning things and talking about which speakers we should bring in. Um, I think it was really successful. I think that it kind of we kind of had a mix up because of uh, some timing issues, but I think we recovered really professionally and I think it was a really satisfying conference. What's your name and what school are you from? I'm Margaret and I go to Moses Brown School. In what was your favorite part about organizing this and do you think it went well? Um, well we worked with Lincoln School and it was really fun to meet all of them and work with them and I think it went really well. I had a lot of fun and I feel like everybody did so.